Hi everyone, this is Trevor Halpern with Halpern Residential at North & Co. And this is your holiday edition of Fireside Chat. Uh, normally this time of year, um, as I always like to say, when people smell turkey in the oven back at Thanksgiving, uh, they, they stop with their buying and selling activity. As 2020 has not been a normal year, uh, that period was not normal. We saw quite a bit of activity. Um, people are still focused getting out there. Um, I suspect in my sense of it, um, of the tenor and pace of the market is the fact that there's low inventory. Inventory is continuing to decline. We've talked about this month over month over month. So we still have very few homes and still have high buyer demand with cheap money. Uh, lots of reasons for people to be moving. We're seeing lots of churn in the market. People deciding, uh, hey, it's time to move. It is time for us to either upsize or downsize. We need a home office. Um, you know, kids going away to college, empty nest. There's just lots of churn. So there's still lots of reasons for people to be out buying and selling, and we're seeing a tremendous amount of activity. Um, we're, we're in that phase right before uh, the new year, right as uh, Hanukkah and Christmas are getting into full swing. Um, typically, people do lose their interest in buying and selling. Um, we don't see a lot of inventory come on the market as far as new listings. Uh, I say it year over year, I do think for certain people in certain market segments, listing your house now or close to now is actually a good strategy. Uh, so you beat the new year, what, the new year rush. Um, if, if you're thinking about selling, uh, it's, it's, worth, it's worthy of having a discussion to see whether now or after the new year would be appropriate. Um, I'm talking to a lot of people who are, who are speculating as to what's gonna happen with inventory in the new year. Lots of buyers and sellers saying, hey, I'm gonna wait um, till after the new year. And that's typically totally reasonable. It's not unreasonable for any reason right now. But in the typical market, we would see come about the second week in January, as people picking their heads up uh, from the holidays in the new year, we'd start to see more activity, a more rush of, of inventory hitting the market. Nothing that I'm seeing or reading is saying that we're going to get a big influx of, of uh, inventory of new homes and listings available to purchase uh, at the new year. I do suspect we'll see a little bit of a bump as people pull their heads up and get into the swing of things. But it's going to be very interesting to see how 2021 um, uh, comes out of the gates. I think it's going to be very instructional and telling um, as to see whether any of this pace and tenor of the market is going to change. Um, so 2020 has been a wild year. Uh, it's shown us a lot of things that we didn't expect to see, um, both uh, you know, geopolitical and with the pandemic and you name it, things are happening out there. They are affecting the real estate market. Um, I would say all bets are off to say, hey, things are just gonna carry on as normal and you know, whatever. Let's just see what 2021 brings. Uh, I'm gonna be as much of a, a viewer of this as you are. Um, we are going to be continuing, we will continue to analyze the market, continue to see what is happening on the buyer and the seller side, and to meld those two to bring a best of breed um, service to our clients and make sure that we are addressing every market condition as it comes and goes. And we see these little micro forces in the market come and go every four, five, six, seven months. And so we're constantly playing with those and seeing how we can engage in the market conditions and provide our clients with the best service, whether on the buyer or the seller side. If you have any questions about what, what is going on in the market, if you have any questions about, um, uh, about your particular situation, if you wanna chat about anything, feel free to reach out, give me a call, 602-595-4200. Happy holidays, happy new year.